Now, Laura, this is your first Emmy nomination. You've been working for decades, really. What, is, what did it mean that, that morning of nominations when you got the call? It was incredible. I mean, I, I really didn't expect it. I was so off my radar. I was shocked and surprised and thrilled and over the moon. It, it means a lot for me personally just because, you know, I come from a family of actors. I've been acting since I was six years old professionally. I've done a wealth of work that, you know, I think that to culminate in this sort of, um, you know, large gesture from my peers to say we think you warrant a nomination is really incredible. We think you have a really good chance. I think either you or Amy and Tina, but you know what? They're not here, so we hope you win. <laughs> we want to see your speech. Thank you so much. Well, I appreciate that, and you know, the company of the people I'm in in this category is so incredible, and uh, you know, I'm a little bit I'm a little bit the dark horse in the race, so uh, you know, but I plan on being I plan on being a little David in, in, with the Goliath there and, uh, you know, going home with the, with the trophy. <laughs> you know, Jeffrey Tambor gets all the credit for disappearing into his role, but you really also disappear into your role. I don't think you get enough credit for that. Thank like, you. That's so nice I have of you to say. One of our editors, Charlie, he, he's a big fan of The Office. He didn't realize he was watching Johanna from The Office on Transparent. That's how, you know, different you are in the role. Yeah, thank you. I, uh, I think that is, uh, you know, something that really does work with Tammy and I... I've been really honored to have yeah, I, you know lots of butch lesbians come up to me and say, I know you're not you know a butch lesbian, but you're like nailing it, you know, and they feel really represented, which makes me just feel so good. I can't tell you how good that makes me feel. And then I have a lot of straight women come up to me and say, well, I'm not gay, but I would totally do Tammy. <laughs> so I'm like, I guess it's working. I guess it's working on all fronts, and that's um, you know, it's it's really beautiful. And I feel like um, I had you know some people come up to me and say they've never seen a character on television that represents sense who they believe they are. And I think the more we can do that, and that's part of what this huge success of Transparent is all about, is that we're representing people that have been so otherized for so long. And um, and I think Tammy, to be honest, I can't think of another like real butch lesbian on a TV show. Yeah. I'm not sure if I've ever seen that. And so I think it's kind of cool that she's, um, I guess maybe there is one on Orange is the New Black, maybe. So now that, right, right. Yeah. But I feel like, I just feel like she, uh, I feel like she's, really, like she's doing something good in the world besides me just having a ball playing her and always she's just so joyful well last question before you go in season three yes can you tell us anything first of all are you going to be in season I'm not in season three. <laughs> oh, interesting so maybe I'll be back in season four I don't know but uh, but I'm not we hope so. you know and I keep thinking like maybe you know maybe Jill will write me something like completely different like like she did with Bradley Whitford this year so that could be fun too to come back as someone totally different well, best of luck tonight. Thank you so much.